can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, now when did you last let your heart decide? I can open your eyes Take you wonder by wonder Over sideways and under on a... Welcome to Bush News. We are going to be reporting on the Donna's Dreamhouse project. Thank you for taking the time to watch. I'm now going to tell you a little story. Once upon a time, a beautiful and desperately ill young girl made three very special wishes after she died on New Year's Eve day, 1996. By her bedside, she left a little red box with messages of her love for her family and her young husband. Donna Cursis had just turned 20. She had spent her last four years of her life fighting cancer. In that time, Donna saw the suffering of many terminally ill children and vowed her legacy would help them live a little more happily in the time they had left. Her parents, Len and Barbara Curtis, have made it their labour of love to fulfil their only daughter's fairy tale dream. as a lasting tribute to her courage. Len admits he was ready to jump off a pier. His family businesses, it all suffered. Instead, they set about making the dream of their late daughter a reality. I am now going over to James, who will explain a little more. Let me share this whole new world with you. A whole new Hello and welcome to Donna's Dream House, the teen centre. Why don't you come inside and have a tour? Hello and welcome to the music legend room, where young people can come and chill out. Hello, this is Victoria's Star Room. Why don't you come inside? I'm now standing outside the Movie Legends rooms. Why don't you come inside and I'll show you what facilities there. I'm now outside the Oriental Legends room. Why don't you come inside? Hi, I'm now standing outside the Asian Legends room. I hope you've enjoyed your tour of Dennis Dreamhouse. See you soon. Welcome back. I've just been told we're going over to our Roman reporter, Ben, in Blackpool Town Centre. Thanks, Connor. I'm here in Blackpool and it's a nice day. We're interviewing people on Donna's Dream House. Yeah. Do you know anything about Donna's Dream House? I know a little bit about Donna's Dream House, yeah. So, I kind of know what they do to a degree, yeah. So, what would you think they do? Off, uh, like, holidays and respite care for terminal old children and the and a bit of a break for the families. Do you think it's for like younger kids or teenagers? All ranges, I imagine. I kind of, 
pitching it in my head as being younger children, just through what so it was on Secret Millionaire on the telly. So and it was young children that was in there then. That's where I heard about it. Yeah. Well, I kind of knew about it anyway, because you, I mean, you can't miss it here in Blackpool. It's, you know, it's kind of well known. Uh, do you know of that? Yeah, I know one girl that's actually volunteered there. Um, I think the Princess Trust were down there. Um, some people that I work with actually have been down there hey! with the Princess Trust. Um, they were helping out with the uh, pathway, I think, putting the new path in there. Doing your bit? Yeah, they were, well, they were doing the bit. <laughs> Uh, thank yeah, you. I know quite a lot about it. Um, I know people who have been there, and like I say, my stepdad's partner, um, we saw it was in there, and she walked to the pathway. We're doing quite a lot at the moment around Blackpool, especially in the colleges, to help the children that need the help like that. So, it's like my, my mother's uh, partner's daughter, she's the same pathway, so she goes there a lot. I think it's a great opportunity for people in need of it and it's a, a good reference for Blackpool and their charity work. It's done marvellous for an awful lot of children and teenagers in Blackpool. really has done a lot. I think it benefits everyone, doesn't it? Because it benefits the people that it's helping, but like, in some I mean, some it's ways, for the children, but it's for the families as well. It's yeah, for the parents as well, exactly. Yeah, because that's the hardest thing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, giving Definitely. the family, like the family is, itself, more time to bond together as well. Yeah. It's just amazing. Mm -hmm. We would like to thank Len, Barbara, Alan and all the special volunteers who have made our stay at the Donner's Dream House a most wel welcoming and relaxing one. My son managed to pack in as much of the entertainment as he could, which has given him the break needed before his long stretch ahead. The kindness of the others has enabled me to take time out with my son, which I may not have been able to otherwise afford. Thanks for the chat, Len. It was just what I needed to be understood. Yours and Barbara's courage is truly admired. Because my son's terminally ill, he's got a massive brain tumour. Has he? Found out in August. So he's not got long to live, between three months <coughs> to a year. So yeah. this is our last holiday as a family. This is Martin. Hello, Martin. Nice to meet you. How you doing? How old is Martin again, sorry? Fifteen. Fifteen, uh, yeah. just turned fifteen in October. OK. Beautiful blue eyes, aren't you? He has, yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> Where I'm going now, I find these people absolutely amazing. And this one has actually touched me most. Hello, Barbara, you all right? <laughs> Lovely. Thank you. What you two do is just absolutely unbelievable. To see two people suffer the way you did with the loss of your daughter and be able to carry on and make other people's lives happy. We do it because we want to pay back to the community for the good that was done to us when yeah. Donna was poorly. There is one more thing that I need to let you know. I've told you one little porky. I do come from down south and I've always worked in a scrapyard but I actually own it, and I am a millionaire. Oh, oh dear. There's a cheque for £20,000. Oh. It's the best cheque I've ever written. Thank you very much. That's yeah. lovely. You're Thank welcome. you very much. Thank you. He's yeah. a big fella to get his arm again. Thanks, Gary. You're, You're welcome. You're welcome. It's my pleasure. It really it is. is my pleasure. It's going to do so much. It'll just make so much difference, Gary. Yeah, keep Donna's dream going. We will. That's, we that's will. what we got. That'll make it keep going. That will. Dream.